I'm going to show you how to mute part of an audio track by removing it. Let's get into it. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. Tap on video and select your video clip. I'll be removing the audio at the end of my selected video clip, but this procedure will work if you want to remove audio at any point of the clip. Once the clip loads, tap the play button to play the clip and make sure it's the one that you want to use. I want this picture to be on screen for the full 15 seconds, but I don't necessarily need all the audio I recorded. Here is my new profile picture for Facebook and Twitter. It was taken on New Year's Eve, which is last night at the time this video is being recorded. Someone may be watching this video two years from now, making that last part irrelevant, so I'm going to remove it. The first thing I'll do is tap on the video clip in the timeline. When you do, some additional options will be activated. I recommend that you make sure you're running the latest version of the InShot app. I'm going to tap on the volume icon where I can control the volume for the whole audio track. You'll see that a new option has been included, Extract Audio. To separate the audio track from the video, tap on Extract Audio once. Notice that a purple bar now appears above the video clip. If you delete the purple bar, all of the audio will be deleted. Play the clip until you want to remove the audio. Here is my new profile picture for Facebook and Twitter. It was taken on New Year's Eve. Pause the clip where you want to remove the audio. Then tap once on the purple bar, and then tap the split icon. The audio will be split at the position of the playhead. Then you can just remove the portion that you don't want by tapping on the trash can icon, which will delete it. Then tap on the check mark once you're done to return to the main timeline. Anytime you make changes to a video clip, you need to save a new copy of the clip. To do that, tap on the export icon, which is also called the share icon, and then tap save. Once you do, processing will begin. Don't close the app, switch to other apps, or interrupt processing in any way. If you do, the video won't process properly and you'll have to do it again. This may take a few moments depending on the length of your video. The video has now been processed and you can find the completed video inside your camera roll. Let's go find it now. Close the InShot app and go back to your home screen. Find your Photos app and open it. Locate the Recent album and your video will be inside that album. Tap once and make sure that you unmute the audio. Here is my new profile picture for Facebook and Twitter. It was taken on New Year's Eve. 